Christmas is here and it's a great time to have joy and to celebrate. That's what we've been talking about all month long. We've been talking about joy. And in case you don't remember, joy is finding a way to be happy even when things don't go your way. We can find joy in a lot of things. Well, in today's story, we're going to find joy in the birth of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Now, many of you may have heard now, many of you may have heard this story before, but it's always a great time to review this story, to look at it again, and to even ask God to say, open my eyes to something new today in this story. So right now, what I want you to do is just to pause the video, read this story, and reflect on what the meaning of the birth of Christ means for you today. All right, so pause the video, and then when you're done reading the story, press play, and we'll continue. You can have joy today because God sent his son. In fact, that's the bottom line of our story today. Again, you can have joy because God sent his son. Lots of reasons to have joy in life, but the ultimate reason to have joy is because God sent his son, a savior to the world to help us and to guide us and to direct us. He loved us so much that he sent his son to come down on earth, to walk among us, to show us God's love, and to show us the ultimate example of God's love by sacrificing his life so that we could have a relationship with God again. So there's lots of reasons to have joy today. And again, it's because God sent his son, Jesus, into the world. So I want you to take a few minutes right now and just think about all the reasons we can have joy in God. What is the reasons that you have joy in God or in Jesus today? I would love to hear your thoughts on it. In fact, if you've got thoughts on that, definitely hit it in the comment section below. I would love for you to share that. And as we kind of wrap up this story, I want to also just look over the verse we've been looking at for the past few weeks. Philippians 4.4 4, Always be joyful because you belong to the Lord. I will say it again, be joyful. We can be joyful today because we belong to the Lord and we have that opportunity because God sent his son Jesus into the world. So I hope you spend some time today reflecting on the love and the sacrifice that God and Jesus made for us today with the birth of his son Jesus. All right, everyone. Well, thanks so much for joining me and join me next week as we kind of wrap up our series on joy. Hope to see you next week. Have a great week, everyone.